Do, 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 do. Did you walk around instead of stomping those barricades? Shit. Welcome, Brigador. So, all right. I've covered this one in the past. This is uh, Brigador, but it has been relaunched. It's now the Brigador Up Armored Edition. So I just wanted to briefly go over a controller profile I put together. Joystick move is on the left pad. We have triggers for fire, which is also full trigger for mouse. We have mouse with gyro for really good uh, responsive aiming. I mean, everything in here is pretty self-explanatory. Now, the one thing I wanted to go over with this game... This one, it launched with, um, tank controls, which kind of frustrated and confused a lot of people. But one of the changes is we now have screen absolute movement, so down will always be down. And that makes it way more accessible. Now, you can switch that back, but that's just, like, you know, if you're reading reviews and people talk about how the game's a little too difficult, it's challenging, they don't like the way it plays... Oh, it's beautiful. Smash everything. But yeah, the, the screen absolute movement... You know, you still... Like, I can still move and aim at the same time, but yeah, that screen absolute movement makes it feel more like a twin-stick shooter. Now, this is not... It's not quite a twin-stick shooter. <laughs> because the trajectory of your fire matters a lot. See, like there, I'm not hitting him. So it's all about where that purple cursor... You have to line it up. Yeah, so then I also put in um, clicking in the stick locks in your movement and aiming. If you don't want independent aiming. But I'm... I got it. I got it. I mean, this is this is why I like this game. I have to go over here. Look at all these cars. Smash them all! <laughs> that's... That's beautiful. It's a thing of beauty. But yeah, this is, um... Oh, I don't like that statue. No false idols! Yes. But yeah, this is um, a completely new tutorial that's been put together. Which walks you through all of it more. So like when you get up to these tiles. The red firing arc is for your secondary weapon. Yeah, you can see my little... My, the right trigger is red. Left is blue. Okay, let's... Let's take this guy out. Stomp. Oh, that's one, like, hold in the, uh, right pad to reload, to pick up ammo. Yeah, this is one that I feel like plays really nice with Steam Controller. So that's, yeah, hold E, ooh. Yeah, it's telling you hold E, but like I said, I mean, I put that as a toggle. Do, 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 do. Did you walk around instead of stomping those barricades? Shit. We can't, we can't do that. <laughs> Stop it! Yeah, a little, little cheeky tutorial. But yeah, this also has tanks. So I have no ammo. So for this one, the stomp button is 
a bull rush, but I also have that as a click on the stick. Smash it! <laughs> oh, running over little people. Rush the smash into the top rocks. Alright, so use my optic camo. Smash him! <laughs> Screw you! I'll run you over! So, I mean, that's that's pretty much it. <laughs> if, you, if you like smashing shit, you will love this game. But yeah, these are all just the tutorials. So that's um, the mech, the tank. There's also agravs. Just to give you an idea, the, yeah, so these ones... Woohoo! Like hover tanks. And they smash to the ground. Yeah, and they can fly right over this stuff. Crush the cars! So yeah, then, then also just as a as an aside, this game has amazing music. I unfortunately have to mute it because I'll get hit with copyright strikes. It's happened anytime I cover this. But yeah, the the soundtrack to this game's freaking incredible. <laughs> this one, I haven't made a lot of videos on it, but I really dig this one. I actually kind of avoid it because I'm it's a high skill game and I kind of suck. I'm just not a high skill player. I just enjoy running around smashing shit. Like usually I'll end up having a pretty good run and then I stomp through a gas station and blow it up. But yeah, then you can like get all these different pilots. You can see up on the uh, upper right, you get different bonuses for using them. You can buy all the uh, different mechs. I have a decent amount here, all the different vehicles. So we have mechs, tanks, this one's kind of funny. Treehouse. Big old minivan up on top of a tank. So yeah, you got different factions. Then we have the agravs. So there's a lot of stuff here. Then you have all these freelance projects. Once you get through the campaign, or you can attack the freelance immediately if you want. And there's just sort of a, um, a loosely teased story, but there is a back... You know, there's a... A backdrop to all of this, there's actually a novel too, which I have read, which was really good, that kind of explains the beginning of the invasion of the Brigadors to collapse the fascist-leaning government, and you're actually one of the soldiers. From your end, you just, you're, you're being invaded by aliens and people from outside of your districts and traitors, so it was, it was kind of an interesting perspective on it plus i really like the way they explain how the like how the mechs interface with the pilots where it's like they're running baseline ai that kind of accentuates what the pilot can do but if you're not careful the machine can kind of start to take over like it's 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 a cool freaking book so i just wanted to plug that briefly too but what's the uh yeah da -da 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 -da. Destroying the guns will cause large explosions. Yes, that is a thing you need to worry about. Collateral damage, because explosions will F you up. That's why I wanted to play this one. Just also to kind of give you an idea, once the game opens up. So they're marked on the corners. That'll be a big, yeah, there you go. <laughs> Watch out for the explosions. Yeah, and then the ammo, you need to match up with your... Ooh. Like the, um, the icon for that ammo matches at the top left the two guns I'm using for this particular one. Because there are... yeah, like, there's different ammo depots. No! <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Oh, 
There, uh, that's cool. Just killed the power. Okay, so now we can get the hell out of here. There we go. Smash some buildings on the way. It's a nice little look at uh, Brigador. It's a great game that's getting some second life due to a, uh, a relaunch that overhauled the controls, makes it much more accessible, has a full new tutorial. And if you don't like the changes, you can set it all back. Change, tank and mech, and then agra agrav. Screen absolute. Right tile absolute. Left tile absolute. Relative was how the game shipped, which is like traditional tank controls. That's all I got to say. I can just keep on going on about, <laughs> about how much fun it is. <laughs> you can just keep on going. There's so much to do. And it really never gets old, stomping and smashing buildings and blowing shit up. So, all right, that's all I got. I will see you around. A lot of rambling, but I tried to stay on point. Don't think about nipples. Be professional. Hit the tires! <laughs> oh, I love this game. Yes, you get it. <clears throat> Yes, I feel it. The energy vibrating. <laughs> oh.